Peace. What's up? Alright, I hit the open mic the other night, but um, the video quality was poor, so I'm just re-recording the pieces that I did. They're very short pieces, untitled pieces. Um, I'm going to give them quick titles as I go along. The first one I'm going to do is called I Got a Crush on You. Okay, I don't have my pieces committed to memory, so I'm going to have to phone home it. One of these days, I'm going to have my pieces on lock here, so I can just spit it like that and, you know. But anyways, I'm going to do the phone poem, but here we go. The first one, I got a crush on you. I got a crush on a poet. He's so fucking fly, like, number 23, tongue out, ow. His words be so New York, corner store bodega, but never confined like the candies in four looser corners, free-flowing like the smoke from a Lucy. I'm attracted. He takes me to different experiences, whets my appetite, I'm salivating, waiting for a new piece, I've been savoring them like glass bites, chasing them with my own pieces. I'm inebriated. Officer! I can't walk no straight line no more, that's for the birds, and I'm a poet. Spitting and shit, I'm enamored, nose wide open, outright smitten, downright with him, all because of his words. I got a crush, poet. I'm in love with your poems. Yes, that, that definitely was an ode to, to a poet. But, um, we're going to move right into um, number two, and I'm going to call this one Three Strikes. Let me scroll up, you know, and get it. Okay, Three Strikes, number two. Three Strikes, and you're out, out, out. No longer a conformist. No one told me the cost of freedom, or did I fail to listen as Malcolm. Fanny Medgar spoke to me. The blood from the baton trickles and runs through my system. Faster than Usain, pass it on to the children. If I'm obligated, then why do I keep my ovaries hostage? Knowing better, I can teach them new lessons like Christians. Get it wrong sometimes in scriptures. Anyone can manipulate. And don't you dare call me the B-word. I'm not blasphemous. I'm sitting here after my third strike. Out, out, out. In realization. I should have never played their game from the start. And the third piece we're gonna go into is I'm gonna name it. I'm gonna name it real quick. Uh, windowsill. All right, here we go. Against the windowsill, some stories above in a New York tenement building, the one that's rent stabilized, always freezing in the winter and extra hot come summer. But the train rumbles just outside. This is our baby's version of Thomas the Tank Engine. Up against it with the flower pots in line. All beckoned by the same thing. And today, so are we. Entwined, half-naked brown bodies like cocoa or rich earth. Physically trying to become what our hearts became. One. Finally, the whistle from the radiator can be forgotten. And even the trains running at rush hour on a bother. I just wonder how many lucky ones will get a glimpse of love. Um, quick decision I'm going to do when I just wrote actually today. Um, called, we can call this one The Elephant. Okay, this is called The Elephant. Okay, here we go. Forgive me, Peter, animal rights activists, vegetarians, and vegans, but I'm slaughtering the elephant. It's taking up too much... Uh, rewind. Okay, okay, what did I say? All right. We're going to do this fourth one. I'm going to call it The Elephant. I just wrote this one today. So I'm really going to have to uh, phone poem it. All right, here we go. Forgive me, Peter, animal rights activists, vegetarians, and vegans, but I'm slaughtering this elephant. It's taken up too much of, it's taken up too much of my room, hasn't chipped in for rent or food, and frankly, I'm too old for this shit. It's got a... What? What? Now I can't read? What? Promise you can read. All right, we're going to run it back one more time. This is my last time, last take. Three takes. Okay, we're going to do this fourth one. It's called The Elephant. Forgive me, Peter, animal rights activists, vegetarians, and vegans, but I'm slaughtering this elephant. It's taking up too much of my room, hasn't chipped in for rent or food, and frankly, I'm too old for this shit. If you got a problem with it, then you take it up. Put it upon your shoulder. Bear this burden from birth before you can tell me any better, bitch. Just throwing that out there because now I got a chip. Sometimes the weight doesn't come off effortless, but even the biggest loser get a, get, got a chance at redemption. I can't hold a tune, but I got them songs too. Oh, pirates, yes, they rabbi. My roots run deep, albeit the culture has been murdered. I'm coming back like the prodigal child to my father's house, and he will take the slaughter as sacrifice. Thank you for watching. 
Much love.